Before the detox challenge, I felt really nervous because I was like, how am I gonna get through five days of juicing? Because <laughs> I've never done something like that. When I did, it was for like two days and I gave up when I was much younger. Uh, during the juicing challenge, uh, like I said, day three was the hardest for me. It's, uh, I was kind of dizzy and weak it felt like just because my body was not used to it. But by the time day five hit for the juicing challenge, I was, I was ready to go for two more days. I could have gone a seven day challenge by it. So it, it definitely gave you the energy that everyone was talking about. And I was like, where is this energy by like day three? I'm like, where is it? And it, it hit by day five. So once you get through it, it was a lot easier. Yeah, the reset definitely, you felt like all the old oily food, it felt like flushed out essentially by day five. So <laughs> it definitely helped. I definitely had less cravings after the holidays. We did like a chocolate making with my family and I didn't even have the urge to consume the sweets. It, it definitely was a good reset, so different than what I usually go through. The detox was really easy to follow. Um, Marcia had provided a pamphlet and I gave you all the ingredients on one page so you could go to the grocery store, buy everything that was on there. And then each page had what each uh, recipe contained. So it had two apples or a certain recipe. So it was extremely easy. The grocery lists are set up so I didn't have to go through each page and you know write down how many apples I needed. Everything was pretty simple to read. So I was actually really surprised by how cheap the uh, uh, how cheap the ingredients were. So uh, I've seen those juicing commercials where you can buy the juices for five days and. Uh, it's like 200 to 300 dollars so i was expecting that um, i actually went to woodman's and it was under 80 bucks for five days it was really surprising on how cheap it was even the the juicer itself was really cheap at, at bed bath and beyond so i was shocking that i spent under 120 130 dollars including the juicer for everything and now i have a juicer so <laughs> nice, yeah. what made me push through the third day was like i'm already more than halfway through. I'm like, I got two more days. And I was really, I really wanted to know what it felt like, because everyone was talking, was raving how good these juicing blends are, you know, the energy that you get, the sleep that you get, um, the cleansing and the, the feeling better and more confident. And it was there, I just had to stick to it. Ooh, my advice for going through the detox. Um, prepare. Um, <laughs> Empty your fridge, uh, get rid of any cravings. So if you, for me, my biggest weakness is mashed potatoes or any sort of potatoes, get rid of it. Um, so it could, it could be chips, it could be candy, it could be anything. Make sure, don't hide it, because it's, it's too tempting, get rid of it. That would be my biggest advice for the challenge, because if it's there, you could put it in your crawl space, you would probably climb up to get it. Um, at least for me personally, so prepare.